Game Maker How To Do Something Everybody Wants To Know How To Do In Their Game Is How To Have A Button In Your Game So That When You Click It uh, You Start The Game Or You Click It And You Go To Your Instruction Page Or You Click It And You Go To The Credits To See Who Made The Awesome Game So Here's Me Making A Button You'll See Here I've Got Two Rooms I Have One Room That Will Blind You Which Is The Yellow Room and I'm going to put my little start button on there. And when I hit start, bam, it'll go to the game room. Okay, so nice, simple process here. Take us a couple seconds. First of all, you're going to need a sprite for your button. So let's create a new sprite. And let's call it sprite start button. And just go find whatever sprite you want to use. Um, I know Game Maker comes with a couple buttons in there. Let's do the play button. Center. I'll just leave it as it is. Now, normally, I find that the time-consuming part of a game, right? Making those things that look good, okay, rather than just weird ones you find on the Internet. But there we have our sprite. Now we have to make the object. So let's go create an object. I'll call it O underscore start button. I'll give it that sprite. Start button. And the code's going to be really easy on this. Is I'm just going to go add event. And if you want it to be on a mouse click, then we just go to mouse. And you have to remember what these different mouse commands do. Global is when the mouse is clicked anywhere in the room. That's not what I want. I want one of these ones here when it's actually being pressed. So you could either switch rooms when they press the button, or what's very typical is you switch rooms when they release the button. I don't really care which one here. I sort of like released. Don't know why. So I'll go when the left button is released. A little bit of code. And the code for room switching, nice and easy. A lot of the room commands start with room, go to, and you have to name your room. Now, I haven't named my rooms very well here. My room's just called room zero, my game room. So that's what I have to type, room zero. And that's it. And now when I hit a little OK, OK, let's go put that button inside the uh, visually offending room. Start button. Bam, and give us a play. Hit the play button, I click down, I'm gonna let go, and it switches to the room. Perfect. That's pretty well your basic button. Now obviously you sometimes have to go nuts on those basic buttons and you have to make a lot of them and different buttons go to different rooms and that's just the way it is. Some of you may want to get fancier like when you click a button you want uh, some sort of fade out effect to take place and the other room to fade in you know that's all doable but uh, we may hit that up in a video later but for now that'll get you going on your buttons. Uh, check out the other video we have here called basic buttons with mouse over so when the mouse goes over the graphic will change. Thanks for watching.